hello and welcome to excellence academy so we are still on chain rule we'll take uh, much exam more examples on chain rule and then work on them let's say i'm given that y is equal to um the third root of ax plus b all squared all right um this all squared fine because i'm giving this and i'm asked to differentiate this how do i solve this um case one the first task here is to express this in index form express this in index form so i'll have that y is equal to um ax plus b all squared now when it's a square root we said root a is equal to eight power one there one over two one is a cube root i'll have that the cube root of a is equal to a to the power one over three so hence if i'm taking the cube root of this term becomes this term to the power one over three so i'll have that this is now equal to this to the power one all over three right that's for the cube root of this all right next up i'll have that y is now equal to ax plus b from the concept of indices this multiplies this to give you what here two over three i'm having this all right next up um, this now looks a bit um, easier to solve all right so i'll take this to be u so i'll say let u be equal to all the terms in the bracket that gives you ax plus b next up differentiate u with respect to x i will have that du over dx is now equal to don't forget we said when you differentiate a term and x it gives you just that term so it becomes a here b here has no um, x attached to it so it becomes a constant hence it's zero so my du over dx is equal to a next up y y is now equal to y is all of this to power 2 over 3 but we just said that ax plus b is equal to u so this is u so it becomes y is equal to u to power 2 all over 3 if i differentiate y with respect to u i will have that dy over du is equal to multiply by the power there that gives you 2 over 3 times u into subtract 1 2 over 3 minus 1 so this would be equal to 2 all over 3 times u to if i work on this this gives you minus 1 over 3 all right so this is now equal to 2 over 3 times to eliminate this minus here i'll take the inverse so it becomes 1 all over so it becomes um, 1 all over the minus is off i'm left with u to power 1 over 3 1 all over 3 all right work on this now this is now equal to 2 times 1 is 2 all over 3 times this is 3 u to power what here yeah? 1 all over 3 so i have this this is the value of dy all over du next up recalling my formula using chain rule using chain rule i have that dy over dx is equal to dy over du times du all over dx so it's now equal to my dy over du is 2 all over 3 u to the power 1 over 3 times d u over dx is um a becomes a of course 2 times a gives you 2 a all over what i'm having here 3 u to the power what here 1 over 3 all right so i have this so this value of d over dx i will express this man this um answer this value here in terms of x so but u is equal to this value here um here's my u a x plus b so hence i'll have that the y over the x 
is equal to 2a all over i'm having this as 3 into u what's u there ax plus b in the power 1 all over 3 so this is my answer or better still you can write this in this form it's now equal to um, 2a all over 3 into this means the cube root so 3 into into the cube root of what there ax plus b so this becomes your answer all right so next up um i think i want to show you something um that is the shortcut for differentiation so there's a shortcut for solving differentiation which i would better still analyze very well in our next class before then let me give you a hint on how this works all right so if i'm given this if i'm given that um y is equal to after my arrangement i had a x plus b to the power 2 over 3 if i can recall what's a shortcut the shortcut is this that the y over the x is equal to what i'm having here is 2 over 3 so it becomes 2 over 3 multiply this by i'm having ax plus b if i differentiate ax plus b differentiating ax i have a differentiating b i have zero so it's off next up if i repeat this it gives me ax plus b if I subtract 1 from here, it gives me minus 1 all over 3. So this is now equal to this times this 2a all over 3 times ax plus b to the power minus 1 over 3. To eliminate the, to eliminate the minus, I'll take the inverse. So it's now equal to 2a all over 3 times the inverse of ax plus b the minus is off i'm having one all over three so that if i multiply 2a times one gives you 2a all over three times this gives you three into ax plus b to the power one over three that's what i had here all right so what does this mean or how is the shortcut done i'll explain this man better in our next video